I'm Robert Field and I am fishing my way through Mississippi. Bouncing between state parks in my RV and checking out all the best fishing holes, cultural hotspots, and delicious eats along the way. It's gorgeous here. This time, we're heading out with Sonny Schindler of Shore Thing Charters to fish some untouched backwater marshes for big redfish. Oh, there he is. Then, there before is. we say goodbye to this great state, we're heading to the Blind Tiger in Bay St. Louis to have them cook up our catch two ways. So much better than when I do it. That's so good. Sonny. Rob. Rob. Yeah, great to meet you. This oh, is Brooks. 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 Nice hey, man. Here. How you doing? Uh, morning. Yeah, no. It's good yeah. stuff. Especially not raining. <laughs> yeah, we're Fine. excited about it, yeah. <laughs> we uh, finally saw some bait in the canal. All the crab traps are full. So oh, we're, cool. We're excited. This is nice. Yeah. Is, hopefully it stays like this. Well, let's, uh, man, I'm ready if y'all are. Cool. Yeah. Uh, we'll we got a, a restroom over there. I, I, He's from Charlotte, North Carolina, and I I live in the RV full time with no home base. So. That's awesome. Much like Brooke. Brooke in here yeah. State Park right yeah. now. Yeah. yeah. I met my wife there. Oh, is that right? 20. Dear Lord, we come to you again today asking for safety, happiness, if it's in your will, a bountiful catch. Keep a safe floor, keep a smiling. If you could, a bunch of big edible uh, hard pullers for everybody out today. And some good footage for us. Uh, please keep everybody's stuff working nice and smooth. Any bad weather, rough seas, bugs, rain, wind. Uh, waves, corona, all that bad stuff. Please keep it away from everybody. A safe return for everyone, please. And while we're out here, please watch over our friends, family, loved ones, even our enemies. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Thank you. few little junctions and stuff where we'll stop and fish where the current's coming in and hopefully the bait's in here but it'll it'll take us a minute to get to the back of this thing okay all right so this will be yours sure it's real simple real simple fishing we'll just put a minnow on there i i may put an artificial just because i'm i'm gonna be driving well we'd be down to throw some artificials but I'm down to do that to start. We'll just get some fish on the board and then we can... Get the stank off. Yeah. yeah you can see how shallow it is in the water, so... A little chilly. Oh, I know. I didn't really expect that. Yeah, I'm kind of kicking myself for not throwing on another layer. Uh, yeah. I know all the stuff we have been catching at the island they hadn't moved out, you know, off the off the banks. They've all been way back up in these things. Like I said, this is this is more our wheelhouse. We've been doing the crappie fishing, cat fishing, which we just knew nothing about, and <laughs> this is more our kind of fishing. So we're at home in the marsh. But when it, this one gets clean, I mean, it's it's so shallow. It's so easy to see them. It'd be nice if we can get y'all some tailing. Like, I, I've been in this thing when, you know, you can barely get get the boat in. And they just, they don't have anywhere to go, man. They just right. sit there and stack up a little bit. This isn't even the, the good stuff. Oh, there's not. Oh, look at that. Come on, come on. He's going right towards it. Oh, there was another one. Where you were just casting. Baby. Come on, baby. baby. Get it, baby. Double up, yeah. Man, he was going right towards you. Which is crazy because he was doing that before it even hit the water. Yeah, he just happened to head right towards you where you landed it. This other one seems like he was coming out towards us. I feel like my... Like you put it in a good spot. Yeah. So we got some redfish. We just spooked one right off the bank in this main channel. And then we've got some up in these kind of back cuts up shallow. We're seeing the wakes of these fish. The water's too dirty to actually spot the fish, but you can still sight fish in this. 
as you can oh, see the yeah. lake's looking yeah, there. He's feeding on the grass down in there. Yeah, yeah on the right cut. side now. What we'll do is I'll try and nose this up. We'll just pin him in. Yeah. Did you tell if he was moving this way or back in? I couldn't tell, but he, it looked like he right, ate something right, right on, on the, the point, point of that grass yeah. on the right. <laughs> that in there. All right, there's, there's your bait. There's a bait. We did this one time. There he is. There he is. There we go. We did this one time in the fall, just like this, a couple, couple ditches over, and our first fish of the day broke the cork off, and the cork kept coming in and out. Oh, yeah. But there was a school of reds with it, so we just, we'd wait, and the cork would show up, and you'd follow it, and you'd follow the school. And you'd cast to the cork. Dead shrimp is what you wanted. Yeah, I mean, it's not very technical, but hey, hey. technically catching fish. So. Hey, could I, could I make you? Net? Where is I, I see it. Yep. Pretty one. Oh, beautiful. I couldn't tell when when he swirled. It almost looked like there was a few with them. Not a bad. I mean, there's definitely more than one fish back in there. Oh gosh, net man. There you go. All right. Cool. Nice. Good, good, good uh, netting. <laughs> <laughs> didn't take long. Oh, beautiful fish. That's a good one. Yeah, man. Look at that. Oh, he smoked it. <laughs> that uh. That'll eat, right? Oh heck yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, what, 23 and a half? Yeah, all day. Some pliers. Well, that didn't take long at all. We just, this first <laughs> pocket we stopped in, we were seeing wakes, seeing swirls. We could tell there were redfish uh, eating in there. And there it is. Didn't take too long. Maybe you know, 10 minutes. Got one to eat. That's him. Yeah. One keeper in the box. We're not going to start to death. That's good. Now, do you nice, wanna good start. Bring one in there. You want to try something different? Where'd he go? It's almost coming uh, to us. Yeah, about, about probably where that. Uh, hold on, that little divot. Yeah. Oh, I see him. Oh, look at his tail. I didn't want to spook him with the cork, so I don't know if I'm quite close enough to that bank. Let's see, I was gonna see if he shows himself again. See if I can bring him out a little bit. There you go. Oh, he's got to bite one of these. Man, his tail came clean out of the water. That was... I just heard something else to the right. Oh, I see it. Yeah, it's coming down the bank at Another us. Another one over here. Where you at? Oh, oh my God, dog, he nailed it. The second it landed, I popped it once. He might come back and get it again. He's oh right. my gosh, yeah, but I got a mess here. Man. And this thing, no, that's not bad. There's a lot going on right then. I did not expect him to just hit it right away. And I set it and he is laughing at me. And gosh, if he hits it now, I'm gonna be in trouble. I got a mess here. Oh goodness, I got my heart, I'm awake now. So he might be living on the left. I keep seeing a little bit of action on the left side there. Oh, oh. there he is. Right, right. Oh, there's another one coming out. Oh, I see it. Out. Oh, there he goes. There you go. He's a little smaller. Ah. Piece of road? Yeah. Oh, 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 oh easy. Oh, I think that's a traveler. <laughs> there he goes. Now he's starting to. Oh, oh. Yeah, it's decent. Oh. That blue tail. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. There, oh, there nice. it is. Nice. Oh, no. That's a, <laughs> that's a good one. Yeah. I think he was just mostly swimming at me at first. Yeah. Just had the guys show me a couple times where the where they were. Yeah. First fish of the day here for Brooks. Sure. Beautiful. Little popping cork, little shrimp. Yeah, me and, me and you are the same with these guys, man. We, we love these things. I really don't care how I'll catch them, to be honest. That's right. Such pretty fish. I know. Mm, I can already taste them. <laughs> <laughs> 21 and a half. So that's mm. well within the well within the slot. Perfect. Nice work, buddy. Oh, 
<laughs> Your turn, buddy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I just kind of kept reeling until I felt the pressure, and then I leaned back into it. Oh, like a crankbait. That's kind of how I did that one. There it is. Close. Nice! Very good one. I don't think it's real big. Well, I think that's what I thought about mine too. Oh, he's yeah. trying to get around this grass. Oh, did it? Oh, no. Nah. Nice. Pulling through. That's <laughs> a small one. <laughs> on the board, man. Yeah. Oh, I love that blue tail. Yeah, the little, ones, the little always ones always lit up like that. More so, it seems like. Yeah. All right, now if you want. You want to tag him? Yeah, I'm going to. You pinch the tail? Not a hard, just... Just kind of... Yeah. I mean, he's right at 15 with the Perfect. tail like that. All right, so my first fish of the day is under the slot, not a keeper, but... Uh, Very active. Yeah, yeah. But Sonny here, he actually does, uh, does tagging. So he's tagging these fish. So the tag is in the needle. And we'll get him up high in this little soft spot here. Boom. Boom. So that number will go on your card. You're gonna chunk them back? Yeah, yeah. And then uh, if this guy gets recaptured, they can you know get all kinds of information on it, where he traveled to and, and how much bigger he got and, and all that sort of stuff. Doing a little work here for conservation and, and research on these fish. We'll put her back. Pew. Nice. He's ready. So how cool is that? We're keeping enough to eat, just keeping a few. And then the rest of these guys will tag and help the, the wildlife department here just learn more about these fish and their migration, their, their movements and, and growth rates and all that kind of stuff. That's cool. Pretty it's, cool that Sonny here does this. Yeah, and it's, it's cool as the second time we got to do it while we've been in Mississippi. Right, yeah, up in Vicksburg, uh, yeah. Bob Crosby, we tagged that 33 pound blue cat in the Mississippi River and now we're down here tagging redfish. So. Just regular taggers. That's Ta it. Tagging and bagging, bro. Tag team. <laughs> <laughs> so, I hadn't put the uh, the secret location yet, but this <laughs> so that number is on the tag that we just released. So we'll have our date. He was in pretty good condition, 15 inches. We measured it, Robert Field, in my excellent handwriting. Um, and then when we're done, we'll mail it to the good people at the Gulf Coast Research Lab in Ocean Springs, Mississippi. And then when it gets recaptured again, it's pretty neat. They send you this map and I'll, I'll make sure you get it. Oh, but it's like a shooting a, you know, a banded duck and you'll see, you, you know, I'll give them the lat long for here and then somebody may catch it 50 miles from here. And Very cool. It's pretty neat. That'd be a treat if that thing, if I end up finding out where that little guy got to. I, I do like exploring, but. Yeah, I mean, I'm cool to explore with you. It all looks, I mean, you know there's, there's few reds in right here in front of us it's just not oh 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 tail 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 right there there it is Red? not big yeah trout. oh is it trout nice nice not a bad one. Look at that. That's a good one for here. Yeah, yeah. Pretty nice speckled trout. Way up here in the in the back country. Fishing a little eddy here. Uh, that's running around an oyster bar. And I mean, not what we were expecting. I thought for sure, I thought it was just a smaller red when it hit, but yeah, beautiful little trout. Not a monster, but that's, that's a keeper, right? They're 15. Oh, yeah. Should we keep that guy? Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely, he says. We're gonna be having a restaurant cook these fish up for us, the Blind Tiger in Bay of St. Louis. I got a feeling they probably know how to cook up a speckled trout. <laughs> it's beautiful fish. Look at the little fangs they got. It's kind of what they're known for. You would not want to lip these guys. Throw him in the box. Thank you, yeah. bud. Yeah, nice little surprise. Oh God, he was on it. Oh. oh. Hang on. He'll get it, oh. he'll get it. Oh. He's right behind it. Yeah. He may even be on it. Oh, <laughs> oh that was sweet, yes. dude. He's Come on, Lee. Yes. Man, I oh. wish I... Oh, and it pulled too? <laughs> That's a good fish. I think it may have broke my line, actually. Cool. Or did it just pull out? No, it pulled out. 
Jeez. Man, that swirl. I wish I had grabbed the camera and, and see, that was, Ooh. that was fun. That's got my heart going, man. I can't believe, how did that pull, unbutton? That's after that twice one. he's, or if it's not the same one, I feel like it's gotta be with, Whew. I mean, that was, there was all kinds of pressure there. Like, yeah. he was pulling drag, you know? Weird. It might, that creek might, Go yeah. on just a little bit around yeah, that bend, and there I might be a little, little I feeder. Think fish just cruising out of there. But yeah, it's probably like a little pack of three or four or something. Still though, you hooked that second yeah. one, and you would think that commotion would have them. Have them. They didn't seem to care at all. Oh, there's a little swirl by mm -hmm. mine. Come on. Oh, you're. Oh no! Yeah, sure enough. Oh. You sitting there with it? They're all just sitting right there. Or that's the same. There's no way that's the same fish. Oh, that's a good yeah. one. Put put that's another one in there. That's a good one. Oh yeah, oh, that's, that's that's what. That's a good fish. Look at that. I saw that cork just. Man, I, mean, I did too. And you were like, oh, is it hungry? He just grabbed it and was sitting there with it. Oh man, come on around. Oh, baby. that's a good one, man. Come on around. Look at that, dude. Look at the shoal. This is thick. Oh, goodness. Oh, yeah. I'm just I'm just upset I lost it now. Well, I, I don't think that's the same one, man. Not after you fought I mean, it that long. We put the hook in two of them yeah. before this one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Great fish. Oh, beauty. That was fun. Oh, God, they're attacking the dead shrimp. You'd think that they would just slurp it down, but they're attacking it like they're mad at it. Goodness. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. Beautiful. Backcountry Mississippi redfish. Golly, I'm. Yeah. You keep filming. I'm about to <laughs> right. You know, like what the, I can't tell if they're stacked. There's no way that's the same fish that hit three times. Dude, there's that'd no be way. Wild right? If there's a pile of them back there. That's awesome. Oh, man, I want my shrimp. Can <laughs> <laughs> get a measure on that one? Yeah, why not? God, goodness, that was an exciting take. Is that right? 24. 24. Still in the slot. Well, if y'all got Mike and Laura, you want to keep it yeah, up? Maybe keep one more. Yeah. Man. Whew. That was. I just said like we yeah. should spend some time filming the corks in case. It's there it is again. Right here, man. That was awesome. Very cool. That was awesome. Very cool. Dang. That was exciting. Just gotta catch like the grass on the right. Oh, look at that! I was going to pop the cork. And he was on there. Yeah, I don't think he's near as big. Well, I'm casting up in no, there. No, I put one as far back in that thing as, look, and he did the same thing as the last one. Going over to this grass. Oh. Nah, a little rat. But still, they're coming out of that little tiny opening right there. Gotta be. There's no way they're all just sitting there in Ooh. that box. <laughs> I got your lens, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm no, sorry. Okay. Yeah, cool. All right, so this one's just over 16. No attack him. Yeah, because I mean, when somebody catches them again, I like to see where these You're right where these things wind up. So somebody hopefully will get it, and they'll call USM or email them with that number. Hopefully, it gets real big and travels far, and we know know a little bit more about them. It's a cool process to be a part of. Yeah. All right. Go get big. Your lucky day. <laughs> COVID was really good for me to, I kind of recentered and refocused and I called my agent and said, you know, hey, no more, you know, if it's not something you think is gonna just light my soul on fire, like don't even call me about it. I don't even wanna hear about it. And the tourism thing was something I told them, I wanna focus more on that. You know, I wanna kind of showcase these places beyond just the fish you can yank out of their waters. I wanna show what, what the people and the places and the history and the culture is about. And so we're kind of, Again, the, the whole COVID slowdown thing was really one of the better things that happened to me in the last five, six, seven years. And like yeah. you said, I don't wish harm on anyone and it, it is definitely a tragedy, but for me personally, it came at just the right time. And uh, this last year has been the, some of the happiest I've been, you know, oh, yeah. it's, it's good. I kind of got back to doing this for the reason I got into it. Yeah, I, and, and look, it happens on this side too. I, right. Just get some. Oh, there he is! There he is! Nice! Did you see it? Mm -hmm. Oh, I saw it. That cork move mm -hmm. just, I mean, a, a, just barely, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, he's all in it. Uh -oh. mm. 
Nice. Again, aggressive takes when we find them. Man, I, I, think, oh, I, I oh. think he's got buddies behind him. Yo, let me go with solid bird. Yeah. Man. This is like full contact fishing. Yeah. Look at all the grass. Yeah, he's all up in that. Look at that. Oh, beautiful. That's good color on him. Oh, no, he jumped the net. There he is. Man, oh, that's chubby one. just healthy fish. Oh. I'm getting a cast out <laughs> Where are you going? I keep getting stuck with the camera in my head. Oh, we got oh, it. Oh, yeah. That's oh. perfect. Here, I'm going to get out of his way. Look how big the yeah, healthy. belly is on that sucker. They are just in here gorging. Oh, look at that. That's got to be one. Mm. Look at that. Spooked away from. Did he spook away? I don't know if he spooked away or if they're just hunting and just, they're just staying in that pond, not yeah, quite coming out to the entrance. Definitely another one in there. Yeah, that was redfish all day. He's looking for his buddy. Where did hey. George go? Hey. Hey. I think I need to get it back further in there. There's another oh, one yeah. in the corner. There's two of them, hopefully between one of the two. <laughs> you know, any day but today, I'd say, how could they not? I think that one's coming for you. <laughs> what do you want from me? What do you want from me? Dude, what the heck? I don't get that, man. Oh. It's still there. Still there. Come on. God, one's going back. It might have even been two. But that one just went back. How did that, I, I feel like I, I didn't even pop it right then. He just like spooked, like the shrimp spooked. Maybe I got too big a shrimp. You ever have one of those days where everybody's in the boat using the same bait, same rig, same everything, and they're all catching fish? Come I haven't on. I haven't experienced that on this trip at all. No. So I just had a redfish spook out i guess he saw my shrimp and got scared i don't know i wasn't doing anything and he just swirled and took off away from it i just can't buy a, a good bite i caught the one under but yeah not really my day so far well and i'm definitely not bitter about it but sonny here's on another one fishing out the back of the boat oh it's a big one. Oh my goodness. And this was the rod you've been using all day. <laughs> Shut your mouth now. Wow. He was just playing with you at first. I was like, he was swimming at you. Yeah, you're like, oh, is it a small one? Yeah, it was That's a right. monster. This might be over slot. Goodness. That one's thick. Thick with two C. Look at this. That's, a, that's over slot for that sure. That one's moving pretty quick. This is a giant. That's a fish on that other one. Is it really? Yeah, it just yeah. went under. Oh my gosh. He's dude. on. He's on. Yeah, you're on. Look at this. Everyone but Rob. Yep, that's fine. That's fine. I'll just I got I got the camera. Yep. Dude, that I mean that's over slot all day, right? Oh yeah. That's all we gotta do is just leave them in the holder. Yeah, I, as long as Rob's not touching it. I, I, put, I put it down to go net his fish and it goes under. And I can't buy a bite. This is oh, don't just, go that way. This is just great. I'm about to have issues. Oh, that's going to be tricky. Got him over the grass. He's over here I'm somewhere. He's just going to go back out somewhere. Yeah, I almost let him swim out with it. Dude, that's a giant dude. Are you kidding me? Look at that. <sighs> Worked him down the grass. There you go. Got him over it. Oh. I'm Looking good. You in the either. You're in the clear now. It's nothing like you were tangling with. You what? tell me both y'all just hooked a fish with not touching the rods I, and I'm up here I like an up, idiot. Your cork was moving. I'm the only one actually fishing, the only one not catching another, fish. This is silly girl. now. Nah, they're both good fish. Oh yeah. Look at that. There it is. <laughs> Doubled up. 
Literally one hit while we were dealing with the other one. God, it's a giant too. Yeah, you know he punched. If y'all want to eat him, then... No, we'll let him go. Okay. <laughs> man, man, man. Look at that. Doubling up on just stud redfish. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Ridiculous. I can't buy a bite, but they're out here chewing. It, it's definitely me. I'm running out of excuses. <laughs> you just gotta set it and leave it. That's probably gonna have set to Set it and on forget it. Crock, crock pot fishing, man. Yeah, crock pot like fishing. The, the color on that was lit up a little, a little bit more. A little more orange. Yeah. Let's see Beautiful. what they do. Goodness gracious. All right, so we'll give him. About 30 and a half. 30 and 31 a half. 31, maybe. 31, so he's over. I'd say. Uh, creep on the 30. I'd say 30, yep. All right, tagging this fish. The last tag in the book at 30. All right, we're just gonna get, see that little slick spot right there? Yeah. Good? Mm-hmm. Okay. Too cool, man. All right, tagged both these fish, both over slot. Now we're gonna let them go. Look at that. A couple giants back to back. Sonny just putting us on them. <laughs> All right. That yeah. felt good. That felt good. All right. All right, big girl. Yeah, oh, she's, she's ready. ready. That's awesome. That was awesome. Uh, I guess we kind of yeah we got it we got to we got to do that right there. <laughs> you weren't even holding the rod. Get out of here. I made the cast with the plan of it floating down the, the bank. The result was the same. The end result was the same. All right, I'll hold the camera. Yeah, you're done. <laughs> but this is nice, kind of best of both worlds. You've got this and and you got the blind tiger and you know yeah, that yeah, kind I of stuff nearby. Come a long way. It's really nice down there. Oh. There it is. There it is. The good one. Can you bring it back? Oh yeah. Oh, don't screw this up, Rob. Let him go if he gets around that corner. Oh, fourth quarter, Rob, buddy. Oh, it's a good one. There's some bulls running through here, man. Oh, he is getting around that corner. Get out of there. There he goes. Oh, yeah. Finally. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I had already given up hope on catching a fish today, a, a, you know, what our target species. These guys have been wearing them out and I just can't buy a good bite. And finally here, we were literally about to get out of here. Brooks was joking about how I've been kind of the fourth quarter. Oh no, get out of there. He doesn't want to be in there. In that grass, right, there he goes. I've been kind of the fourth quarter comeback kid this whole trip and here we are literally minutes before we're getting out of here. <laughs> finally, finally got one and it's a good one. God, dog, it's a good one. I'm going to my other line now. Oh, come here. All right, you wanna grab the net? Yeah. Yeah, you can set the camera down. Oh yeah, he's a good one. Not as big as yours, I don't think, but he's up there, he's up. Look at that. Oh yeah. Oh. No. All right, I'm gonna swing it back to you. There it is! <laughs> Victory! Oh my goodness! And for that to be the fish that I finally got, I mean, just makes it that much more special that, that I had to struggle through it. That is awesome. Oh man, fourth quarter kid, like we were talking about. I heard the cork go clear. Oh, I popped it a couple times around the edge, right on that little point, that man, little corner. If you, don't, if you don't mind, here, I got you some pliers. Measure them, and I'll uh, I'll uh, pop the tag. There it is. <sighs> Look at that in overtime. It's just not been my day. We've all been laughing about how I mean they just can't help but catch fish even when they're not holding the rod, and I just couldn't get a good bite. Tag that girl. Look at that. What a got a measure yeah man. to me i mean i love the struggle like it just makes it that much more rewarding and exciting you know if we come out here and i was just hammering them that's one thing but gonna call it 28 and a half lovely
28 and a half inch redfish. That's over the slot. Uh, gosh, that feels good, you guys. I had given up. I mean, it wasn't even, I wasn't even fishing on hopes and dreams. I was just going through the motions and we literally just threw the drone up. I'm sure you could probably hear it. And uh, we're just trying to get some shots right before we got out of here. And then there it was. I said, I'm gonna go ahead and fish hard while Dr Brooks is flying it and got it done. And gosh, it feels good to get a fish. All right, tag this beauty. Now we're gonna send her back on her way and we'll be able to come back and see. Oh gosh, I about went in. <laughs> she was ready to go, huh? She was ready, I was almost ready to go with her. I didn't want to let her go. Sonny, thank you, man, for sticking it out with us, grinding through it with us. It was hey, not hey, automatic. We Y'all weren't grinding. <laughs> easy there, fella. No, that was fun, man. I appreciate you, you you working hard. Such a pleasure. This guy has just been, I mean, just even if we hadn't been catching fish today, he's just a fun guy to be around. So knowledgeable about the area. Hit these guys up. Sure thing. Fishing charters. This is, uh, it's what a treat. What a treat. Look, look. Are we moving or is... That may be a fish. We're moving. <laughs> All right, don't get ahead of yourself now, Rob. <laughs> Oh. I need to probably get that down. Success! Yeah, all right. <laughs> Goodness gracious. All right, we're gonna get out of here and we're gonna go click these fish up at the Blind Tiger, sweet little dinner bar and grill spot right here in the Bay of St. Louis near Buccaneer State Park where we're staying. They're gonna cook it up for us. I'm excited for this. We need to get back, get these fish cleaned up. Let's do it. Man, Sonny, thanks so much, Good brother. Work, man. What a blast. Good work. What a blast. This is my kind of fishing, y'all. And it's cool to see what Mississippi has to offer in terms of marsh fishing. This is this was special. We're, we're gonna be back. We will be back. I wish I had more time. I want to catch more. That's a, <laughs> that was so fun. Easy peasy. Man, <laughs> that went bad the first time this trip. <laughs> Alright guys, we just got back here to the shore thing, kind of base camp where we launched out of. Sonny's about to clean up these redfish and that trout that we brought back. Then, instead of us cooking it, this is actually our last night on this trip, this Mississippi tour. Instead of us cooking it up, we gotta take Brooks back to the airport early in the morning. We're actually gonna go to the Blind Tiger, sweet little bar and grill, right on the water here in Bay of St. Louis, close to Buccaneer State Park where we're staying, and they're gonna cook these fish up. And I have no idea how they're gonna do it. We don't know what they're gonna do with them, but we're bringing the fish, and I guess we'll find out. I'm so, excited about that. It's gonna be, be good. Cool. No, we walked by the place, it looks yeah. sweet. You've got Golden Boy right there. He'll cook whatever you want. Well, I'm cool to let him do whatever he wants, too. You know? What a blast. Awesome, yeah, Thanks Thank so you. much. Thank you. Thank you. So, Sonny may be coming back with us to the Blind Tiger, but he's got more important things to do. We'll see. We're trying to talk him into it, but. Either way, just what a blast. Where can people find out more about Shore Thing? We're not hard to find. Uh, ShoreThingCharters.com uh, or yourself, you know, the office phone, 228-342-2206. If you can hear it over the... Yeah, right, fans. right. <laughs> Cannot recommend this guy enough. Again, even if we hadn't caught fish today, it was just a blast being on the boat with him, hanging out with him. And we, y'all caught a bunch of fish today. I got the one that I got. It was close. It was close. Yeah, I feel better. No, I'm, I'm impressed. Thanks so much. You man. got. You, you do it, man. You figure it out. Fourth quarter rod. That's quarter, what they call yeah. it. That was a buzzer beater. That wasn't even fourth quarter. Yeah. Was, it might have been overtime. <laughs> Such a good time, man. Thanks yeah, again. Man. Truly, truly. Come, uh, come back and see us. That was that was cool. Yeah. Uh, we'll, we'll be back. We'll be back. We gotta come back for triple tail. Yeah. We're gonna do that. Yeah, with the fly rods. That's the one thing we forgot to, although I wasn't really nah. going for style points at the end, I was just anything. <laughs> All right, so we're heading over to the Blind Tiger right here in Bay of St. Louis, not far from the state park. And one thing I'll say, you know, the longest man-made beach in the world is, is right here in this area, 26 miles of beach that didn't exist till man made it exist. 
And I'll say this, that I've never in my life even thought for one second about the Mississippi beach scene, but it's pretty cool to see, I mean, they're not powdered sugar, but nice white sand beaches and people out here with their dogs, people hanging out, playing frisbee, playing volleyball. You don't think about beach vibes when you think of Mississippi, but it, but it's here, it exists. And I, it's almost feels like one of kind of the better kept secrets in the US in my travels. I had no idea that this, this was a thing, but it, it's pretty cool. It's beautiful here. And the blind tiger, I've just heard amazing things. We saw it the other night, but I think this is gonna be this is gonna be a good time. And Mike Jones, the tourism guy, just texted me and said that the owner told us to come hungry, and I haven't eaten since 6:30 this morning we're on our way out to the to the fishing trip. So I think we're in for a treat. We're about to be there. We'll we'll see what it's like, but I'm feeling good about this. Well, I was delete this file because and, you know sometimes you just gotta keep things a secret. Yeah, right. I mean. You know? So a lot of times in my travels, I'm like, Do I should I tell everyone yeah. about this? Because next time we come, it's going to be twice as busy. Because the show is huge. <laughs> it is. No, not really. Yeah. We were freezing this morning. The ride out. She was rough. Thank y'all so much. I know y'all are so busy right now. And, and just... So they're cooking the fish over there. All right. Is this ours, do you know? Yes. Yeah? Yeah? What's your name? Crystal. Crystal? Yeah. Do you mind being on YouTube? Sure. Uh, I appreciate you. I appreciate you putting up with us. <laughs> so what are we doing here? What? Are... So I put in the beer batter for you. We have our own beer batter we make. Your own in-house beer batter? Yes. Oh, I love and it. And then we get our fish fry and I batter it up real good. Get it on the track. I got a feeling that's gonna be good. This is y'all too. Yeah. Um, they got y'all quite a big bag, and then he's got your grilled fish. The grilled fish, fish yeah. yeah. I'm Jesse. Jesse, you don't mind being on YouTube? Not at all. All right, brother. Nice looking fish right here. Yeah. If I throw this inside down right here, we're gonna finish it off on the shelf. All right. Flat top, I like it. Yeah, it was a blast. My first time fishing in Mississippi. We released a bunch. I'm sure our guide, he tags them. Yeah, that's my favorite fish right there. That speckled trout. Speckled trout, yep. Real yep. clean, real light. Right. I'm a redfish guy, but. Yeah, redfish is good. All right, I'm going to go ahead and just get out of y'all's way. Thank y'all so much for putting up with me. We were worried, but Sunny showed up. Thank God. That's right. Looking like we're ready. Ready. Got most of it going. Got a Look couple more fried pieces and some fries coming out. Oh, God, sorry. Hit you in the face with it. You mind a little lemon on your face? 
All right, Brooks, get in there. The whole piece? Sure. There's four of them. Grab the whole thing. Don't be shy. Oh, I'm always a, just a little shy. Just a little. That's not what the ladies tell me. That's like it's got the steam test. I see it. Yep. Proprietary secret batter, secret uh, seasoning here. It's so much better than when I do it. It's so good. I need to know. I'm about to go back in there and figure out what they put on that. Delicious. That's that's fantastic. Doesn't get any fresher, and I don't know what they did to it, but they made it better. I, that's real good. Alright, um, thanks, Sonny. Enjoy the fries. That's good. Why don't you try the black one, the, the half shell? Alright. Mississippi. When we got here, I didn't have overly high expectations. I really didn't know what to expect at all. But it took no time at all to realize just how much this state has to offer both tourists and outdoorsmen. From crappie fishing and hatchery tours, to river monsters and blues music. From urban kayak fishing and shrimp boils, to oh, big is. reds and beach vibes. Mississippi truly has something for everyone. But when I look back on my time here, there's no question that the people of this great state are what had the biggest impact on me. Y'all take care. All right, brother. For these people, Southern hospitality is simply a way of life. <laughs> One thing I know for sure is that Brooks and I will definitely be coming back. And I am so glad that we didn't miss out on Mississippi. Learn more and plan your trip at Visit Mississippi dot org.